Come on, fight for it. Get up, get up, get up. Push it, push it. Tristan. Tristan? Yeah. Tristan. Braden. Braden. Yo, I'm, I'm hurting right now. Y'all, hey, for those who's watching right now, I literally just came from an hour straight of football conditioning workout. My body is just like torn down. But I'm gonna still push it out. We got Tristan and his bros right here. They're hitting some incline right now. I just walked in, I did some bench. I already did incline myself. Uh, I probably throw a 500 today. Depends. But you get warmed up and hopefully, yo, I, I, I smacked the shit out the rim, so. Like, I, I yam that out, bro. So that joint's like hurting right now. Oh, come on. Oh. I like to tell people, oh shit. I like to tell people is, don't waste too much time getting your weight up. If you're going for heavy weights, like you just wanna really take a couple reps, get it out the way, a couple reps, get to your, get to your starting set weight. Don't like have these wasteful, uh, Wait for reps. There was a guy that I met at the gym. He would took like, it took him an hour to get to his single rep max for bench. It should not take you that long to get to a single rep max at all. By that time, you're done. Like I come in here, I get in the weights, and if I if I if I take more than 30 minutes, y'all know I'm not gonna do good. So you definitely want to come in here, get you warmed up, get set and ready fast, and then go for your one rep max. In all my years, never seen a 16 year old soccer player at that. A soccer player, never seen him train this type of stuff. Usually, when, when I grew up back in high school, soccer players always did stuff outside on the field. Never really in weight room. Weight room, it was always like a light, lightweight, high reps, more of an endurance type stuff. Um, and it was kind of pretty much opposite of football. Football, we did a lot of heavy weights, we did a lot of weight training, period. I mean, we did outside stuff as well. So we had the best of both worlds, but to come and see a soccer player, I don't even think I was, I definitely was not at that level of 16. I was more like of the performance side. Not really look-wise, but performance-wise, you know, I was there. I didn't really care about my look at all back then, because I had abs and I was good with that. You like shredded, swole like that? Hey, tell, I told y'all, two a days, man. Yep. I mean, if you got the time for two a days, do it. I mean, I'll usually uh, I'll do my workout, my lifting in the morning, take my break, eat throughout the day, do whatever works. Later on, find a hill, do some sprints. Like two days is great.
We did some chest crossovers. Right here. After three sets, 20 reps. Here. I'm not looking too bad for just kind of like bullshitting. Body's falling apart right now. Forearm hurts. A little bit of shoulder. It's just sore. I'm just gonna take tomorrow off. Probably next two days. Ice myself, sit in the pool maybe. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. My name is Jeff.